the M2187 Thunderstruck. Welcome to the murder show. And oh boy, do I have a treat for you today. We have us a Jittermod shotgun in the Quartermaster Collection. Three round burst M2187. This thing is so ridiculous, so overpowered, so over the top, and so much fun to use. They say good things come to those who wait, and I've been saving my keys, saving my salvage points, waiting uh, on the day when they put some new weapons in the game, and we got the Wreck the Halls edition of Quartermaster weapons that totally changed the way that the gun operates. Look at this shit, man. Just look at the destruction. In this gameplay you're watching right here, you can back it up if you don't believe me. The dude in the first place, I got put in this game late. Dude in first place had, I think, 22 kills. I came back from 0-22 in this gameplay, man. It took like three minutes to clean this map up. Look at this. Told you, bitch, I'm Luke Skywalker. <laughs> I love it, man. I love it. Playing World War II has made me just appreciate and love Infinite Warfare even more. Just how fast you can move around. Look at the range on this thing. This gun is fucking sick. When I pulled it out of the drops, I didn't even really know what I had. I read the description on it. It said it was a three-round burst shotgun, and I instantly thought uh, my epic Banshee. I can't think of the name of it. It's shooting three-round bursts. When I got the Banshee, I thought it was going to be a beast, but it's really a piece of shit. This is what the Banshee wants to be. This this thing right here, nigga, is gonna get nerfed. So if you're lucky enough to have it, please take it out on these car streets and have a good time with it. Cause you see, I damn sure am. This, this thing is unstoppable, man. This shit is unstoppable. I don't know what the hell I'm gonna put in the thumbnail, in the title. It don't have that much range, though. It don't have that much. But I was out here pushing it. This was the warm-up game before the stream last night. And uh, this right here is where I started the stream. So if y'all was wondering about that game I was talking about, this was it right here. Probably one of the, the most epic comeback I done ever made. I actually think I made a comeback from 23 points one time. But uh, I ain't show. But even better than that, I think I went 30 and 4 in that game play. 30 and 1 on Scorched. I just got this gun yesterday. Well, actually, I got it a few days ago, but I just pulled it out on the streets yesterday. It, it, it's so easy to use. It, it's it's such an overkill. You know what I'm saying? Because each one of these bursts <laughs> is enough to kill somebody with just one shot. Each of the three bursts is just as powerful as one burst from the base variant. You see what I'm saying? It ain't like the bench. And I'm not complaining. But you know they don't like putting guns in the game that have everybody crying and complaining. But luckily, not that many people had this gun. Because it's locked behind the quartermaster wall. And obviously, uh, so far, I'm the biggest YouTuber who have it. Because I ain't seen nobody make no videos on it. I did a search. The biggest YouTuber had like 500 subs. <laughs> and like 3K views on the video. So don't nobody really know about this shit yet. But this is the M2187 Thunderstruck. In case you was wondering the name of it, I think that's the first time I said it. The most overpowered shotgun in car history. Probably the most overpowered gun, period, in car history. It's been a long time since I had this much fun playing the game. Just looking at this gameplay right now, I'm ready to get back on there and do it some more. 
A lot of people hate shotgunners. It takes some skills to be a shotgunner, though. Normally, a shotgun is only good as good as its wielder. But this gun right here, man, is so fucking good. I bet you could take a Billy with a negative KD. And as long as he plays positioning right, he could tear the whole lobby down. If you thought the, uh, the dual wheel 2187, the salvos, was pissing you off, <laughs> wait till you run against somebody with one of these. I don't even want to play with nothing else. I got all the best supply drop weapons from the Quartermaster. I took advantage. I had a bunch of credits and shit, a bunch of keys. I got all the good weapons. I got the Atlas Annihilator, the Rag 9 Firebug, the, uh, what else? Can't even think of the name of all of them. The, the, the G-Rail Cyclone, the fully auto G-Rail. That's another overpowered gun. I'm about to make another video about that one. The one thing, the only thing bad about this gun is the fact that they got a small clip. I think they start you out with uh, 12 bullets, if I ain't mistaken. So it's a must that you run scavenger and pick up is the scavenger packs when you kill somebody, when you see one on the ground, because you're definitely going to need it. Anytime you see a gun that got a small ammo capacity, you already know that's an overpowered weapon. The ammo capacity is the, what they did to try to hold a gun back and nerf it. But, uh, yeah, as long as you counter that with scavenger and pick up your packs, you're virtually unstoppable out here. Unstoppable. This gun is incapable of losing a gunfight. The only time you're going to die is if you totally just fucking miss all three shots, which if you do, you, you fucking ass. It's your fault. You deserve to die. Or if you just get shot in the back from bad position. Ugh. You know, shot, using a shotgun is all about using the element of surprise. Coming over the walls on them. Sliding around a cone on them. Lingering and waiting on their ass. Sound horn. I mean, ear hustling they bitch ass. Nah, this game is even better. How can you be better than third and one? Going absolutely flawless, baby. We dropping two nigga nukes on them today. Two 30 KD gameplays. We don't play. Be sure to hit that like button if you enjoy yourself. And uh, welcome to the murder game. I love Frost, one of my favorite maps. I, I love working this back area. I know the spawns. I know he not somebody not chasing me. I'm the wrong nigga to chase with this in my hand right here. Oh man, they gonna be hating me. You got to love it. If you have it, if you have it. Now if you don't have this gun, people gonna hate on this gun. People gonna be crying in the comment section. Oh my god, this thing is so overpowered. It needs to be nerfed immediately. Cause they don't have it. <laughs> if they had it, it would be a totally different story. If a lot of people had it, it would be a different story. But this, like, this is some legendary shit right here. This is where the intro clip come from. Oh. Uh, Luke Skywalker, bitch. I love that shit. Wrong nigga to run up on, bro. Wrong nigga. Come on, somebody coming fresh out the spawn. Get back in it. <laughs> Who wants to run up and get fucked up? Fresh out the spawn, nigga. They ain't even got time to move. Now, I'm, I'm being dirty. I ain't gonna lie. I mean, some people call it dirty. I say I'm playing smart. I would be stupid to be running around the map looking for people and shit. Like, I don't know where they at. I know exactly where they coming from. I'm a wolf. I'm gonna catch them in the fucking path. Matter of fact, I'm gonna catch them right when they come out of their fucking hole. Big bad wolf with this goddamn thing. If you got it, shout out to you. Thank the card guards for blessing you. If you don't, uh, this is definitely a gun that's worth spending some money on. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I guess they wanted to put something in the supply drops that was going to force you to finally go ahead and spend some money on IW. Because you know we don't spend money on IW supply drops. We didn't spend hundreds on Black Ops 3, but not IW. Oh, I bet you some people going to spend some money now, though. Shit. Hopefully, you got salvage credits, salvage points, whatever you call it. Because you get quartermaster hacks for just 1,000. 
with no limit. So you can get as many Quartermaster guns as you want, depending on how much salvage you got. So take advantage of that shit. I definitely did. On some real shit, too. I wasn't recording it or nothing. I wasn't doing it for YouTube. I wanted these guns, and I was dead serious. <laughs> fuck is he doing over here besides being stupid? And see, this is how I go. You see, I done crushed the lobby. They ain't spawning back here where I'm at no more. And everybody's smart enough not to come around here. So the gameplay got a little dead. I thought about cutting it and editing it. I say no. So for all this game, I want them to see every fucking minute. Every second, because I would. Eyes on target. Danger close. At this point, I had realized that I was flawless. And I wanted to go ahead and get the flawless. This was in the live stream last night. Being smart, hugging the edges, killing niggas as soon as they spawn in. Still got the bubble wrapping on them. Warden saved my life. Somebody bound to be coming up out the spawn area. What is he doing? It ain't nowhere to hide, bitch. Hold these nuts. Pause. Gotta get you one, man. You got to get you one of these. M2187 Thunderstruck. A fucking machine. And Happy New Year to everybody. I don't know when y'all gonna get this video. Probably New Year's Eve, you know what I'm saying? We gonna be doing a live stream tonight. Be sure to fuck with your boy, man. And if you enjoyed the video, be sure to pimp slap the piss out of that like button for your boy. Leave me a comment. And be sure to hit that motherfucker subscribe button and don't miss none of this call to do the real shit. It's the murder show. Fuck with me.